All right, that's the big front entrance to the Olympic Park. And there is uh, an eternal flame in the middle on the bottom there. You can't see it from here though. Oh, here's something. It looks like it's the flags of all the countries that participated in the 1988 Olympics. I showed you this in another video, but I just wanted to get another picture of it. It's an IV for a tree. I guess it goes into the roots. That's nice. It's a tree doctor. Cool. All right, what I have to do, I have to cut through the park there to find uh, the next cache. This is called a virtual sphere. And it's something, I'm gonna get closer and see exactly what creates that effect. It's metal tubes on strings Huh, interesting. We're in a um, we're in a circular flower garden. It smells fantastic. There's a cache here. It is a mystery cache, and I had to come up with uh, the number of gold medals, silver medals, and bronze medals that Korea won in the 1988 Olympics. Plug those into a formula to get the coordinates. The coordinates are nearby. Let's see if uh, let's see if I was right. Let's, let's see if I did this right. Well, the coordinates brought me here to this thing. This has a stamp inside like a um, like a notary stamp. Which is weird. It's bolted in there. But also inside was a geocache. Well that one has uh, four sets of pedals. So it's like a family sedan. Ah, cool. This is called the Mong Chong To Song wooden fence. I don't think it's original. Is it original? No, it's not original. It's a recreation. Um, this was a retreat castle for the king during invasions somewhere around here So Korea was invaded a lot, so I guess the king came here often Here's something I haven't encountered before There is a cache there the Carmen says it's a cache, but there's no name no name is appearing I uh, can't make you see. Can you see that? There's no name. So, so I click on it and it's a traditional cache but there's no name. It's a micro. Um, some of the description must be in Korean or something else that this can't read. I don't know if I uploaded it or what, but we tried to order a pizza yesterday through Pizza Hut. And they eventually told us they don't deliver to hospitals. There's a Pizza Hut delivery guy here at the same hospital. Maybe they just don't deliver to foreigners. That's probably more, more likely.